Hello and welcome to another episode of my Cam's Informed Let's Play. Um, I've decided to sell another load of silage bills. Um, just to get rid of them essentially, because we have almost a full stack still left to sell here and it's going down really slowly, so I just want to get that sold really. We can make some more space. So we might be putting a silo down there. So I need to figure out still what we're doing with our uh, wood chip bales. I think I'm going to have to try and buy the sawmill to get rid of them. Um, I think this, we've tried everywhere else. Uh, that's all we can do. I'm going to take them down to our production area. Maybe I'll leave them there. I do need to take the strawberries that I separated, put them into the bakery as well. And we do have a lot of fruit and vegetables that we could probably sell. Um, that's about all we can really do today. Um, so we might have to just rest up until we're able to start looking at planting. We should probably actually do some um, animal work and odd bits and pieces. Uh, yeah, there's not going to be much to do because we're Right ahead on everything. I just need to get more um, plants in the ground. I'm just going to leave those bales there for now before we get our. No, before we think of what, what we're going to do with them. Uh, the sawmill is probably the only hope that we have. I don't know if you can like buy the sawmill and then sell it, so I need to just see what. We've got 8,000 litres of strawberries to go to the bakery. Um, I did put all the butter that we had in, which was like 6,000. I don't know how much eggs we're going to have. But apparently, we've maxed out what we can do on strawberries. So, that's right, um, it looks like we've almost maxed out what we can do with butter. Must be able to take seven. Um, I turn that off. I need to activate it again to get a couple more. Okay, we will. I think we're still at good prices for our lettuce and stuff. So I don't think we store it much. We'll see what how much load we get on that. Yeah, so we'll take all this extra stuff back into the farmer's market. Just totally empty it from now. Yeah, got a decent load here. So we'll get this down to the farmer's market. And uh, then we'll bring this back here. Um, I think we'll uh, maybe pick the wheel up on the way back. Just so that it's all at the production site. Just because that's where the pallets are going to be, so we may as well just pick them up on the way back. Do need to possibly feed the cows if get them probably off camera. Do that, I'll get this delivered, we'll get the wheel back, we'll get the sort the cows, um, and then we'll probably rest up for a few days. There's not much else we can really do. We do have like bread to keep selling, but um, we'll let that build up for a bit. Can't do much with the cake, I need for the eggs to kind of start being produced, which they are. Yeah, we can only really do this, get that done. Like, we're just waiting on spring, like most farmers just doing odd jobs until we can uh, get in the fields. Not too bad, not too bad. 20, 27 and a half. Here we get this back to the production area via the cow farm to pick up those wheel bellet. And then I'll get the new Holland down into the cow farm. To get the food chopped up for the cows. Check on the chickens. And I will see you. Probably, probably check on tomorrow, maybe. Second day of January, we'll see. If not, it might be 
February or even March. It depends what there is to do. So it moves on a day. Um, come down to the sawmill because we're going to try and buy it uh, and get rid of these. Come on, then we need to see if we can actually get rid of the sawmill after. They don't really need it. Okay, we're going to buy the sawmill. And now we're going to try and get these bales in. That has cost us a bit of money. Which we're not going to get that. And, uh, the, the whole um, bales is not really worth out for us at all. It does not look like this is going to work out for us at all either. Um, well, you can only put wood in the summer and reduce this, so there's literally nowhere to sell these bales in this map. I'm just going to leave these here. We can't do anything else with them. It's a total loss, uh, and now we need to try and sell this place. I think I'm going to have to get rid of the old buildings. I'm not planning on doing wood anytime soon. We were 45,000 back from that, so we lost 55,000. Basically, the wood has just been a disaster. Or the, the bales have just been a disaster. But we live and learn. Um, but something different. I enjoyed doing it. It's just. Oh god, we went really wide there. Very slippy. Um, yeah, it just doesn't seem to work on this map. So, yeah. We'll get this down to. Actually, yeah, we'll load up with the bread that we have. Um, and we'll get the bread sold to get our money. Yeah, let's, make, let's try and get a mill. Let's try and get a million in the bank. Okay, we're off to the garden centre with this. And once we get this done, we will need to look at. We do want to have a quick look. Basically, we need to get a slurry tanker for getting rid of our slurry soon. Um, well, I'll say soon, when we get our um, cornfield planted. We also need to look at a corn planter. Now, I'm not sure if we're going to uh, buy one or just lease one. So that's what I want to look at as well. Leasing, maybe, but I don't know if we're going to do corn again or we're going to do some flowers or something like that. Um, yeah, I need to see. We might do sunflowers at some point, just so we can do some more. We even get an oil refinery just so we've got a bit of everything. It might be a good plan, actually. Yeah, we'll get this sold. Uh, let's see where our money's at. Uh, I think we'll just have to rest up again, to be honest. We can't really start doing much until we can get planning. We will look at the uh, shop to see what planters and spreaders we can get. Okay, that garden's in it. It's gone pretty down pretty fast, that's good. And that has taken us over a million. Perfect. We've still got wheels to sell. Um, that's about all we've really got left to go. And let's see what we've got. And you sure? Ooh, that is literally what we need. But that is much more power than we currently have and can handle. For planners, I think we're going to go with this one. Because it does everything we want. And you don't actually need to cultivate with this one either. So that is a benefit. Um, but we'll look at that when we need to. Again, yeah, not sure whether I'm going to buy it or just lease it. See what our money's like and what fields, other fields we're going to buy. Yeah, actually, with that, we can look at what fields we're going to look at. So I don't know how much of this field is. Field five is like can take all of our budget over budget. Field two is a nice producer. It's whether we go for like two, like two fields because you get six and two. Or we just go whole hog on one big field. That is the question. 
14's a very nice producer as well. I think 6 and 2 overall are pretty good. And we can afford both of them. Those would probably be the ones we'll go for. Right, we'll get this back. Uh, as I say, we're going to have to rest up anyway because we can't start planting anything until March. And we've sold most of our stuff anyway as well, so we can't do much until March because that's when we can sell the wool and we can start planting. Yeah, I think we're just going to rest up till March. So we are now into March. Um, I can't sell the wool yet, the price is not good. Yeah, it's getting there. It's not quite there yet. What we can do is start doing field prep. So we'll go away to hop onto the menu. Okay, so we are looking again. Two fields. Said before, we're going to get this one. And field set. What I'm also going to do is I'm going to dissolve the lease on our bottom field because we just can't really do anything with that, to be honest. What we also need to do though is get our soil samples. Okay, so we are all purchased on our soil samples for our two fields. Um, I think that did probably bring our rating down. Not much, to be honest. Um, yeah, now we can get to field prep. So we need to plow, mulch, and plow this one. Uh, I'm just leaving this one as is at the moment. Um, we've got grass in it and we're just going to keep going off with that. So yeah, we'll get the plough started on field two. And um, once we've got that going, we'll get the mulcher hooked up to New Holland and started on field six. So we'll probably do two times around and then let a worker jump on. It has been cultivated this field, so it does seem a little bit silly to plug it. I just want to get it done because we want the most yield out of what we put in it. I'm not sure what's going on in this one. I decided not to put in, in all the fields. So we've got three fields to plant now. Uh, we'll definitely put corn in one. Um, and then I think we're going to do sunflowers. Might do something else as well. Just, just... I'll get this. Out. And this is when we are getting the mulch yourself. I feel like you could probably use a even lesser powerful tractor. Um, it's supposed to be 150, this is 140, so we could get away with it less, but this one worked. We just need to pull it on the road, that's actually where it struggles more than pulling it in the field. We'll get a round done with this, and then we'll check back in on our plow. Done. Hang on, get done. Do 
do need to get this one to play as well, so I need to look at what we're actually going to plan in the future. I think we can plan, um, sunflowers just now. You know what else since we've planted, so I need to double check what we're actually planting. I don't think we can plant corn until like 8 though, so that'll need to wait, but I think that's going to go in our hour. That's the better for the old over there. I'm just going to get a second in actually, because that one went really fast because we're building that uh, light. light speed around this field. So the case is slowly but surely getting there. Um, I'm just looking to see what we can plant. We got wheat in, which is good. Um, we can get sunflowers done, which is what I will want to get a field in. We can't do corn till next time. We've missed canola because we can't plant that just now, unfortunately. And then we do. I could do soya beans. I'm not too fast about doing the soya beans. I don't think we can do any. Production with soybeans. It's just straight up sell, isn't it? What price do soybeans go? I've not actually done soybeans. I have to hang on to them for a while. I think we might just do two fields of sunflowers then. We'll do these two in sunflowers. Okay, we'll pay off on our loan. Not too far. The case is getting the plowing done. However, I do think we're going to have to upgrade it. Or, an alternative, I don't think we can upgrade power wise. Okay, there's not much difference between those two that we've got. They're way too wide for our farm. Um, and for the old New Holland, you better with a subsoiler. Yes, yeah, so you get four meters. That we could get that. Right, we'll get into the New Holland now and get the um, luncheon finished and then go to the shop and grab that player. So that's the mulching done on this field. So we'll get this taken back to the main farm. We'll go and get the extra plough that we're looking at. And yeah, we'll get this started. Because the other tractors can go, oh, you'll get enough. So we may as well have two tractors plowing. So we had to go for a totally different option. Because the one we're looking at. Um, doesn't fit this tractor. I did think it was a risk. Um, so we tried it before we bought it and it didn't pick up. So we've got this one, Maggie, I think it is. It goes 7 miles an hour and 5 meters wide. It's not super fast, but it's the, as wide as we can really get for this power loop. I did also purchase a weight for the front of this. We've got a fun weight on.
We're just going to lease this. Get it filled up. Once it's all filled up, we'll get this back to feel good. Do two rounds. And then we'll have to work together. Now it's clear that our worker on with the sip is the one, so we will check on them as we will pass it. I don't think they're finished, I think they're just finished. One half of the field. Okay, so we'll get two rounds done of this. And we'll the worker off. They'd have to move the other worker. Um, too long for this done. We'll have to tidy that field up a little bit. Oh, that's not too bad. Let's so we'll go to. Yeah, we have one round on that. That's quite wide. for today. If you've enjoyed the video, please give a like, subscribe as well if you want to, and I will see you again next week. Goodbye.